Hey guys, welcome back to Bear One's Burden. I'm Joe. Today we're going to talk about uh, the cost breakdown um, for and material use for the Flamingo Room. Um, I'm going to basically uh, talk on, on the video as, as the video is playing and I'm going to uh, point out um, what was used um, and I, I'm going to put the description um, of all the materials and everything down down below in the description section. But yeah, so um, it's just me walking you through the room and um, telling you what we use, what it costs and, and, and things like that. Uh, so let's just jump in the video and, and um, hope you guys uh, enjoy. Um, the video starts uh, from the outside of the room. Um, as you can see, the, the as you're gonna see, the the door is sanded down. So out outside of the door, it is we are gonna uh, stain it. So that's that's gonna look a little bit better for the hallway section. But uh, let let's go ahead and jump in the video and take a look. First of all, um, a lot was done in this room. Um, we we basically uh, demo a section of the walls, um, uh, the ceiling. We had to demo the whole ceiling because once we started taking the wallpaper, it came down. Half of it came down, so and then we had to remove all wood trimmings um, uh, to get uh, elect electrical work done behind and, and, and stuff. Um, we framed out the closet, the walls, and the door, and we and we, and we closed off the, the the entrance door that was leading to the master uh, bedroom. Um, again, we ran uh, electrical circuits, um, install, uh, installed outlets, wa a wall heater that you're gonna see as soon as we enter the video and light fixtures. Um, we scraped off all the wallpaper um, and hung up ceiling, uh, drywall, patched up plaster, tape and mud, uh, installed wallpaper, painted, sanded floors, and hung up the window treatments. Um, so yeah, so uh, the video starts outside and uh, we see the door that is sanded down, which is gonna be stained, like I said. Um, it will bring that that wood, the original wood wood color out. Um, as you can see, we we got brand new light fixture and ceiling medallion that I found. Uh, that I think it matches uh, good with the house. Um, uh, right now we have uh, this this ceiling, this wall uh, electric heater for now until I work on a on a more permanent heating section. Um, for those of you who are interested in this style of bed i put the description below where i found it um the wallpaper um i i found it i found this design um, um at a store that sells uh, from things from london and uh, they have a, a good quality uh, and, a, and, a, and a variety of, of designs and this is the only <laughs> flamingo wallpaper that i liked since he likes flamingo so um the window treatments are, are, are basically found in um in Amazon, um, I think, in my opinion, I think it fits the the, the decor for the house, the age of the house. Um, this bed, um, it, it's metal frame. Um, he didn't want a, a traditional wood uh, style frame, um, so I tried to find something as close as possible to to fit the the, the decor of the house. The floor um, took quite <laughs> took some work. Um, uh, I had to rent a machinery in, in Home Depot and, and and sand it down. And um, I wish it would have came out a little bit better if I had a bit more time to spend on it and take more time. But it is what it is. But it came out pretty good. Um, he wanted some uh, spotlights above his bed, so I installed those. Um, yeah, the, the paint colors, um, I listed them in the description section. Uh, they're, they're bare, uh, brand. Um, all of the, the hardwood, I kept this. It's original hardwood, um, hardware, I'm sorry, hardware, um, for the home. So I just, uh, sanded it down and, and painted them back up, but, uh, and got them working. So actually the skeleton key now works before they were stuck you couldn't get the skeleton key to operate but now they're there the both doors both hardware uh knobs are, are working 
so yeah guys um that is the breakdown on the, the cost of the entire project for the room uh when it comes to uh materials with with the bed is is about three thousand dollars um but if you remove about maybe um a thousand dollars off of that for the bed itself and the mattress then then the project came out to about two thousand dollars um in and supplies and material this is not counting um uh, sweat equity or, or labor or anything like that this is just uh, uh strictly material wise so yeah guys um i hope you guys enjoyed uh and uh, stay tuned for the next one if you haven't subscribed subscribe and please guys give a thumbs up for the video so it could help the channel all right see you guys later